It was very important to them that the dogs had a little bit of set savvy already, that they kind of had had a little experience. Um, uh, Butler, who plays our eight-year-old Enzo, um, he's, he's done mostly commercials, but he's, he's got a great you know, background in, in the industry, and so he had a lot of experience. And Parker um, is relatively new. Uh, he'd only done maybe two projects before, um, and so he had the most to learn in this period of time. In the, in the first two weeks of training, it's really just letting them get to know us. And it's not really a formal training program per se because they don't know who we are or what we're about. And so it's mostly about just hanging out and finding out what toys they like and what treats they like and maybe what makes them tick, maybe you know what makes them nervous, what are they uncertain about. What we specialize in really is animals portraying the character and appearing to be untrained, working in a natural manner. And so that's the biggest accomplishment that we have on this is making it look like it's Denny's dog. And he loves his Zoe and his Eve. I mean, that's his family. And uh, it was very important to Simon that, you know, the dog's got to show these emotions. He can't just be a dog chasing a ball and, and a, a dog looking at the trainer the whole time. And it's really part of the specialty of what we do, you know, is, is spending the time with the animal and, and uh, uh, finding out how best to work with him and to not distract or take away from the actor's performance with him. It's a real s subtle kind of balancing act that we do.